when David Ross hit a solo home run in the final game of his career. Cubs lead was at three. It was an eighth. The Rawls tap and gets into trouble. I've been up at double. Uh, Rajay Davis hit a two-run home run to tie it. At six, this went into extra innings after a short break away. And then in the tenth, Ben Zobras comes through with an RBI and double down the left foul line to break the tie. Cubs pull two in that inning, but the Indians don't go away. There's Davis with another huge hit there. An RBI single to get within one. And then let's take a look. Finally, two outs. Chris Bryant charges the uh, short hit. Throws out the runner in time. There it is. Cubs win. Final score, 8-7. to seven, Their first championship since 1908. Imagine being in there. Yeah, the champagne was spraying all over the Cubs clubhouse in Cleveland. The celebration is bigger than many have seen, and why not? The Cubs just broke the longest drought in sports history, bringing a World Series championship home to Chicago after 108 years. Listen in. It's hard to control the emotions. I do my best, but I know what this means to the city. And to every generation that is, is talking to their parents right now, you know, people that have, they've lost, uh, the, the, the Cub fans and the fun we have is just, this is... It's, I just know what it means to them in the city, and it's amazing. It had to come down to this, did it? Extra innings, a, a blown lead against a team that's, that's had such a drought that you guys have as well. 